yeah, I'm gonna keep it 100 for a second. I ain't trying to be cringe or anything like that. But bro, this year is about to end. You gotta end this year freaking strong. You literally gotta go out there and achieve your goal. You need to stop complaining about life, bro. Because everybody has that moment where they feel just, you know, depressed. But you gotta learn to embrace that moment to become more of a mental, stronger person. I hope that makes sense. But anyways, it does make sense, you know what I mean? But bro, you just gotta go out there and cheap your goals, bro. Because it's hard to really climb the ladder when there's people out there who's pulling you down so that you can stay where they are. But like, no, man. If that happens, you literally need to kick them, metaphorically speaking. I don't want you to go out there and kick somebody's face off like you're Spartan. But I'm just saying like, bro, don't let no one stop you from achieving your goals. You just gotta go out there and do it. It begins with you and it will end with you. That's all I'm basically saying. You need to start that story that you've been driven in your mind this whole time, literally been dreaming about, they been daydreaming about. You literally have to bring it to life, bro. Because it's just a fantasy. To me, in your mind, it's this fantasy thought that circles surround you, but you never really catch it and brought it to life yet. Because you've been scared that people are gonna, you know, judge you. You feel like you'll lose a lot of friends, but at the end of the day, you, you got those who are gonna support you. You got those who are gonna hate you. You know what path to choose. You know where to go with this. Because you might have been that cool kid back in high school. I'm gonna keep it short. You might have been that cool kid in high school who, you know, went with the the crowd basically like, hey, I got the new shoe, check out my Jordans, look at what you're wearing, Jordash, whatever, whatever it is. But then you end up changing, but now your friends are looking at you like, bro, what happened to you? You changing on us? I'm like, bro, I ain't changing. I'm changing myself. I'm trying to stop this fake popularity and actually become popular. I don't know where I'm going with this, but <laughs> in some ways it makes sense. It's like I literally created a story and brought it to life. But what I'm basically trying to say is, bro, you need to change the way that you act around people. Well, depending on the situation, but you need to change the way you are as a person. If you're lazy, fix that. If you sleep a lot, fix that. Less sleep, more work, waking up earlier. I don't care, 4 a.m., yeah, you gotta wake up at 4 a.m. to literally start your damn day so you have like better time, schedule, everything feels more neat. I know, it's, I know you're gonna be tired, but it's gonna work well once you continuously do it. And the best thing is to actually wake up at 5 a.m. I know a lot of people are gonna say, no, you need your eight to 10 hours sleep, but what's really going on when you're sleeping for eight to 10 hours? You're just dreaming about your goals or something, actually going out there and achieving it. That's the thing. It's literally like you're in the simulation and you haven't really got out and actually do it. You know what I mean? Like you've been living this whole dream in your mind, literally. Like you need to bring what's in your head to real life in a positive way. Like you literally need to start there, then start cutting down the ways to, you know, to get there. Like every time you do one goal, you know, okay, next time you go for a higher goal, you just gotta keep on going, never freaking giving up. But bro, I'm going a, I'm a stop talk. I'm gonna stop talking because I'm sorry, I'm not even speak at all. But hey, go out there, achieve your goals. 2019 is around the corner. You got the power, use it for good. I right, peace. <laughs>